And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. Double A baseball on the show coming your way. It's the Harrisburg Senators and the Reading Fighting Phils. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. First pitch moments away, showing the slab in today's game. Adam Leverett and Chris, he's hoping for some better fortune moving forward. Well, I'm looking to see if he can increase the amount of swings and misses and perhaps get more strikeouts because hitters are batting over 300 against him, and that means guys are getting the barrel to the ball. Exit velocity's got to be pretty good when you have that kind of bat. And a pitch. Line to left. The wind and the pitch. That to right. Slide, and he catches it. Well, really nice looking play right there for the out. And I can say as a former outfielder, it's nice to get down on a level where you can really see the ball into your glove. Some people think that it might be easier to stay standing. Now at the plate, Chad Castillo. And that's in there for strike one. One down, base is empty. Hit in the air, right field. Rutherford I gets it, under it. it. And there's two away. Take a look at the lineup. Singy, we're looking at a really young lineup here, so not much experience, but it also means they're going to bring a lot of energy to the table most days. Well, we're in a golden age of young players. I mean, these players, they're getting up to the majors. They're dominating from a young age. Bringing home plenty of hardware early in their careers. I mean, before they even get to free eight. Vimael oh. Machine. Oh, no. Next offering is in for a. And fouled off. Two down, nobody on. Out to short. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. He decides to eat it, and they can't get the out. In there, and it's 0-1. Foul ball there. And that one is lifted in the air. It gets down a base hit. So that's two straight two-out hits. In there for strike one. Kicks and fires. Swing and a ball popped up. Number 10 settles underneath it. But it's the pitcher that makes the play. And that will end the inning. End of one. And we're still scoreless. And welcome back. Bottom of the inning. And now, number 46. The first base. And a pitch. Fought off. And now the 01. That one the other way. Makes the catch, and there's one gone. Batting seven. The center field. Madison. And here is number 32. That one's in there, 0 and 1. And here it comes. That's in there. He goes down looking. Man, that thing just barely got the zone, so you almost can't blame the guy for laying off. I mean, with the way knuckleballs dart all over the place, realistically, that could have just as easily missed by four or five inches. It's and now, number 30. And first offering is fouled off. There's a strike.
Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. Got him. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. So they make short work of him there. We play two full. The Senators out front here, two to nothing. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Here's the catcher, Jack Conley. The catcher. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. Right hander kicks deals. Popped in the air, left side. And out number one on the grab. Now, now the designated hitter, Garrett Whitley. Back to the top of the lineup. Number 28 digs in now. He's someone that you might not describe. First pitch, and that's in for a feed. The fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. Strike two. Righty delivers. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Got him looking. That's out number two. Maybe a little bit of overthinking at the plate right, right there. Right, right, right. You want to be patient yeah. with knuckleballers and not well, give into that go. pitch that's going to dart out of the zone at the very last moment. Castillo in the box with two. You'll want. There's a strike. Oh, and two now. Got him looking for the K. A controversial called strike three to end the inning. Three up, three down for him there. On to inning number four. The Senators with the lead two to nothing. Bottom of the fourth, and down the shortstop, Vimael Machine. And he deals. Line drive, base hit. Around first, digging for two. In safely. It's a double and his second hit. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. And you can feel this crowd. Yeah, he swings and misses, and it's nothing you'd want. Fouled off. He was late. On a line, base hit. Throw quickly into third. They're at the corners now to start the inning. And he'll pull into second safely. Well, he wasn't afraid to hit with two strikes. I think he choked up a little bit, maybe spread out, but he got the job done right there. In there, and it's 0-1. 0-1's the count. And the pitch. In the air to left center. Hassel heads towards it. Makes the grab on the run. Runners tagging from second and third. Lay at the plate. Not in time. He's safe. And they trail by one. Well, that's a quality at bat right there. You know the situation. You need something in the air and deep enough. And that's exactly what he did. Good pass to the baseball. So digging in, number 46. He's over one. On the ground, right side. And he handles it himself for the out. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him. In there. In the count. Next offering is in for a strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First, the pitch. That's hard hit in the line. White makes the grab. And that is the third out of the inning. A lot of adrenaline, we can see it right there. And sometimes you just got to let it out. That's an outstanding job of taking that, executing, and getting out of a tough inning. Welcome back. Here's the third baseman, number 30. Third baseman. Johnson, back to work. Pitch is in there. Top of the zone for a call. Here's the 0-2. Fights it off. He'll see another. In the air, center field. Hassel moving under it. That's mine, that's mine. And there's one away.
Now a catcher. Now the catcher up to him, Jack Conley. He popped out his first time. That one's in there, 0 and 1. And a pitch. In there at the knees, 0 and 2 now. Out to center. Hassel moving under it. Me, me, me. Two down. Now the designated hitter. So the lineup flips over. Now it's the DH, number 28. And that's in there for strike one. That's that one ball. drifts inside. The righty deals. Out towards left center. White under it. And that's the inning. Bottom of the sixth inning. Go. Now it's the right, right fielder, field. Chad Castillo. Right field. yeah. Johnson back to work. Line drive. Knocks it down. He doesn't have a throw, and they don't get the out. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. That pretty much That's split the zone out. down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make a pay. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. In the air, left field. And that one gets down. Fair ball. Clearly seeing the ball very well in this one. I don't know how he's able to shoot that pitch the other way and still put something on it. That pitch was inside, and he let it get really deep. So pretty incredible hands to fight it off and still get good wood on it. Now a pretty big at-bat coming up with a chance to even this ball game up. First and second, no outs. Number 22. In there. For he swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Hassel moving under it. I got it. Brings it in. Runner tags it second. And he moves up 90 feet. Runners at the corners now. One away. The bat. Number five. Second baseman. Cameron. Cameron. Two on, one out. And now Cameron Cannon. He's 0 for 1. He's looking for a ground. There's a strike. Big pitch right here. He's going to try to make a pitch. It's going to produce a strikeout or a ground ball. And that one is lifted in the air. And it falls. The throw into second. And that's the second out of the inning on the force play. Throw home. He beats it. It's 2-2. Two -two. Wow, this is one of those plays that happens sometimes, but it never really should. It seems like you just got a bad read on the ball, and the good throw from the outfield was perfect to get the out. And first offering is fouled off. Sam Diaz. Swung on, popped up go, on the infield. Makes the grab, and that'll do it. One run, a pair of hits, no errors, and one left off. We're through six full. We are tied 2-2. Back here at the ballpark, set for the last half of the seventh. And now it's going to be number 32. The right-hander back to work. And that's outside. Looking to get the tying run on base. And one and two. And there's a the ball. The tying run at the plate. Still two and two. After. Bounce to third. Lays out. Oh, it's off his glove. Not in time. He's safe. A perfect example right there. That plate discipline, it pays off. The deeper he gets into a count, the more comfortable he becomes, and he usually wins the battle. Manager out of the dugout, and he's going to make a change. Bubba Johnson departs, and a nice effort out of him, no doubt. New arm coming on. We'll be back for that in a moment.
On the mound now, Gerardo Correa. He last pitched two days ago. Number 80, Gerardo Correa. one here today and your final 5-4. A one run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.